Florida motorcycle racer William Bill Warner, who in 2011 set a speed record of 311 miles per hour over 1.5 miles, has tragically died attempting to secure a new record. Warner was at the former Loring Air Force Base in Maine with the hope of hitting 300 miles per hour in under a mile. Event organizers marked off 2.5 miles of the runway for the trial with an extra 2,000 foot buffer. Warner was on a modified turbocharged Suzuki Hayabusa. He set off without incident and reached a top speed of 285 miles per hour. Then, after slowing to 260 miles per hour, he somehow lost control of the bike at the 4,000 foot line and came off. Warner came to rest 1,000 feet from his bike. Emergency vehicles responded instantly. He was reportedly conscious and talking when emergency responders reached him, but passed away just over an hour later at Cary Medical Center in Caribou. Police and racing authorities are investigating the precise cause of the respected rider's untimely death. He was 44 years old. Even when accidents do happen, people often walk away from them, but unfortunately, that's not what happened this time, said race director Tim Kelly.